Here and there, they find charred relics in the debris of vanished homes. In Ipswich, water threatens people's homes. The town becomes a lake. Families are marooned in houses, and rowing boats come to the rescue. At Bramford, three miles away, the collapse of a bridge has cut off the inhabitants from the outside world. In the worst floods for 30 years, strange sights are to be seen in Ipswich, where, they say, dozens of new cars may be going cheap. Various methods of progress are employed, the most ingenious of which is to use a couple of chairs as stilts. Apart from its lighter side, however, it's a very serious business. Aerial views give a good idea of the extent of the inundation and the difficulties and dangers involved. What a winter it has been, and it's not over yet. Snow falls thick on the towers and battlements of historic Windsor Castle.